I don't I don't want her to go. Like, let's just call it what it is. I don't want her to go. <laughs> Y'all look at me. <laughs> Y'all Michelle to be Malachi. She made me do this. She made me do this. Yeah. She doesn't like she's always saying tacos are too salty, they're like a bag of salt, but she's eating them. Oh, is it time for an upgrade? Not really. It's not. I don't know. It's so cute. I really like this black with black interior. yesterday don't get me we got home and i got y'all down here because i'm at my kids school and um, i'm getting ready to go to a spring concert for my daughter uh this morning at nine and then they're having something right here right now at eight so i'm about to get out the car and go do that but um i did not come back and see y'all yesterday when I got home, well, I, I don't even know the last part y'all saw. We was at Roscoe's Chicken and Waffles. So we left Knott's Berry Farm about 6 30, 6 37. We got to Roscoe's Chicken and Waffles around a little after 7. And then we stayed there probably for about an hour because we got home around 9 15, 9 20. Baby, when I say everybody went in that house and crashed, we all went in that house and crashed. I got in that shower. I got relaxed because I felt so dirty just being out and just, ugh. And I showered before I left, too. But I just felt so nasty. So I didn't. I went, took me a shower, got in the bed, and now here we are. So got up this morning, got dressed. My daughter had a little meeting this morning, so she had to go to that. And then now, like I said, I'm sitting outside their school getting ready to go in for what they call a den meeting. Um, and then they also do, um, so I can record, get a little footage and um, all of that. So yeah, girlies, mm -hmm. I am, yeah, so I need to record and all of that. So I'm going to save a little footage from my camera so I can go in there and get a little footage on my camera. Or do I want to? Well, yeah, because by the time y'all see this vlog, the kids are not even going to be at the school no more. So it don't even matter if y'all know they went there or not. So I'll record it. Because like I said, by the time this vlog get dropped, we'll be in Washington already. Mm. Housing update. Um, We have what's called a first sergeant, which is the person that takes care of like the airmen and stuff. Um, as an enlisted person and so I talked with my supervisor that's out in Washington and she gave me like a little update as for the housing goes the way that the army does it because it's a army led base we have to follow the way that they do things do I agree with it a hundred percent no because I don't feel like you should get on the wait list once you leave your duty station I just think it makes too much sense and clearly for them that just doesn't make sense to me but it's the rules that we have to follow so um there's nothing i can really do besides literally leave california and tell them that's when i'm departing and when i'm available for a house i think it is the stupidest thing there is but it's nothing i can do about it i could pull him about it all day and nothing's really gonna change so that's pretty much what that is um and yeah that's that's what it is so i am let me get out this car i just want to give y'all a quick update on that but let me get out the car and go in this meeting and then i'll see y'all on my way to work after i get done with this meeting and stuff and then you should have one other paper just behind you do not need it right away fifth graders take a look at me make eye contact with me make sure you have those two pieces in front of you does anyone need a piece of music that somehow did not get to them I just forgot about my kitchen. <laughs> hey. 
Hey, girl. Good morning. Nah, I know, doggone well, the camera was on the charger. Girl. <sighs> like, I know I put it on there yesterday. Anyway, now see what I'm doing. But guess what? It's my last ship day. My last ship day ever. Y'all, it's my last one ever. And baby, when I say excited, excited. And I believe there's only like nine people today. Right, tomorrow, right? I'm out of time, you dress. But yes, y'all, it's my last one. And you know, my lips be so dry. So, I stepped on the scale this morning. I don't know why I did that. Now, I knew I was gaining a little bit. Dang, this is the heaviest I've ever been. Y'all know I just went on a 75 hard journey. And I see why people say the 75 hard journey is cool and all. But it's not a long-term thing. Because as soon as you do it, that you're going to go back. It's not like a, you know, yeah. I don't know how to say it, but I've heard a lot of people say it before, like on YouTube and stuff. So some people agree with it, some don't. And the ones that don't, one of the things I heard them say was like, it's because as soon as you do it, you lose the weight for that time. And then if you don't stick to it after you finish it, it's like, oh, okay, oh, well, I'm done. I did it. And I was 100, I am 165 pounds, 165.8 to be exact. I am not okay with that. So... I want to start intermittent fasting even on this little road trip that we about to take. I want to focus, unless there's a good spot. I don't even want to talk about it because I say that that's what I want to do and then I don't. But that's where I'm at. I just know once I get where I'm going, I am going to really focus back on making sure that I work out and get back focused because girl, I've been off. I've been off focus, okay? And it shows in this weight that I'm carrying. So, it is 6.48, it's not even time to leave the house yet. Um, yeah, I don't know what I'm about to do, but sit here. But I definitely want to come and say good morning because I have not seen y'all in my kitchen in a really long time. Um, I got up at five this morning to tackle devotion and everything in my binder i need to show y'all my binder because i went ahead and combined my entire binder into one so let me just take y'all upstairs because there is some stuff that i could be doing in my office so while i'm for these next 10 minutes or so only thing i really need to do is put my shoes on so let me take y'all upstairs to my office and show y'all what's going on in there and I need to grab some tampons because my period hasn't started yet, but I feel like it's it's gonna be coming. Glad I came up here because girl, I need this. So pretty sure I showed y'all what the office looking like but I know I'm gonna be MIA for a little bit because of the move but what I think I'm going to do my savings challenges I'm actually going to travel with because those are super easy for me to cut up put in a um put in a thing and go so I'm going to travel with my savings challenges binder my whole punch and then I'll just take everything to the post office and just ship it out in their packaging and pray that it's not expensive as heck. So, I might travel with my scale too, but I'm just trying to take my little hole punch out because, you know, that stuff is super easy to travel with and it just goes, you know, in my bag. So, I'm going to travel with my hole punch and then I'm going to travel with some of my savings challenges that way i could still get y'all you know y'all 
savings challenges out. Now, I only have a few, so once they're gone, they're officially gone until I get my household goods, but at least we'll be able to still ship some stuff out because right now I do have two orders in the queue that um, people are interested in, so I'm going to ship that out before I leave. I'm not going to bombard myself for sure, but once they're gone, they're gone. So, that's the plan. The office looks really good, like... Like, really good. The office looks really good. So, I'm going to tackle a lot of this next week while I'm off. The first day that the movers come is on the 17th. So, I'm going to tackle a lot of that while I'm off work. Um, I kind of want to bring my computer with me today to edit. But, I don't really want to. So, because I still have to edit when my mom then was up here. I don't know. Anywho, let me get my butt. Oh, y'all saw I took the flowers off. Let me show y'all what I put them. Do y'all remember this right here? This little book that... Oh, who was this? Capital Chic? Yeah, Capital Chic. So, I put all my stickers in here. That way, I can put them on my wall. And they actually all fit. So, I got all of them in this little book right here. So, I was going to travel with this book. I might still, I'm going to just put it in here just just because. Because I might still travel with it. But I'm putting all my my um, savings challenges in there. But yeah, girl. Let me get my butt out this house and to work. So that way, when we get back home later, the camera can be charged and good to go. Um, and I will definitely see y'all once I get off work. Because I'm definitely going to come in here, do those orders, and clean up the house some more so if y'all are interested in like behind the scenes of the moving stuff y'all gotta go check out the next video or the other video that is like the pcs vlog one two whatever so yeah you don't care what you're doing to me i've been down in the ruins so deep all the games they are playing over love you're forsaken, you let it slip away oh, 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 You don't care what you're doing to me Every setback, every mishap Every time you say you gon' change So you get it, you regret it I forgive it, but you stay the same Just spread a little bit The Duke Decay Over Right 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 she's doing with her school this morning they're having that today we just got up so that I could me and her just got up so that I could take her to it I'm mean, trying to set y'all up put my glasses on find my chapstick but 
Me and her just got up. And we are getting things done. One second, though. But, yeah, so, like I was saying, this morning, she has her her um event with her school this morning so i'm walking around trying to find my chapstick because my lips feel super dry i got these eye patches on because baby this mama is tired these are the good molecules caffeine patches or something for like tired eyes and baby i'm tired this mama tired but i'm looking for my chapstick so I can put my chapstick on girl Hello. I already picked up my outfit last night look wait let me show you she got like I'm not finna see her so this shirt I have to find my long shorts you wouldn't let me wear my other ones? You're right. I wouldn't let you wear your other ones. And we we got to do some of that hair. <laughs> Can you oh, chill out? Oh, now you stop. Oh, oh never mind. Okay. Girl, it's not that serious. Okay, ma'am. Hi, ma'am. And Bella, calm down. You are... No. <laughs> I think my other child is already up. But I'm not going in up. Um, yep, he up. I just... Yeah, I'm sure you ate something. Good morning. Good morning. I gotta take Michelle to her thing. I'm coming with you. How you know? I wanted you to come with me. Hey, y'all. Hmm? <laughs> All right. I mean, you need to put some clothes on there. Alright, let me grab my little... Hold on, y'all. Okay, y'all, I found my chapstick, so... Um... <laughs> my little outfit of the day is literally that same two-piece set from a guy back home's company that I, um... that I know. And... Is from his brand, so so this y'all know that's like my go-to little outfit. <laughs> I put that on anytime I go somewhere. So I might take Bella with me. I don't really know yet, and girl, cause she be doing the most <laughs> with that whining and crying and stuff. So I'm just trying to get us going this morning. So I'm gonna see y'all. Let me just get finished getting ready. I'll see y'all in the car. This on without it, dog. I'm glitter in it. <laughs> All right, it's better than nothing. Okay, so I'm heading to take much to. We gotta go to this little store first. Um. You got everything you need because you got just kind of fizz. Are you still, you got personal <laughs> stuff? Um, I'm on, so. Uh, so, yeah, that's what we're headed to do. And um, I'm going to stop at this little store on base, like what we call it. I always call it the shop, bitch, y'all. Um, I hope the way that the camera is, like where the camera is, I hope that y'all like this angle and it's not too much of a distraction seeing a little bit more of the car. Um, but I felt like moving it over there would have been a little better and I felt like it would have got, you know, it wouldn't be so up close in my face. So that's why I moved y'all over there. But that's um, on the agenda for today. When I get back, once I drop her off, um, my going away is this afternoon at 6 o'clock. So, she is taking the bus to this place. But when I when it's time for me to go pick her up, I'm going to... I wonder if they're open. Do you think they're 
Okay, let me see. Uh, when it's time to go pick her up, I'm going to go pick her up myself. But y'all, it's like an hour out, so I gotta leave her kind of early. So, one second, I'm trying to see if this little Marine Mart on base is open. I think the barbecue starts at like 5 or 4. Probably MCX five. Marine Mart opens 5.30 Monday. Damn. <coughs> but one of them says... Those things are open every day. That's what I'm saying. Because okay. me and my friends, we always go down there and just buy stuff. Let me see. I mean, it is kind of early. Don't get me wrong. It is very early in the morning. So, I'm going to just go see if the big one is open. Because I really hope they are because it would be super nice for them to be open. Um, so, I don't have to go off base to a gas station or something. Anywho, but yeah, so that's what we're doing. I also got to return her Crocs because I bought some Crocs. And so, those were like an inch big. Man, I need you to be with me for that. So, we probably do that tomorrow. So we gotta return to Crocs this weekend. It is Saturday, by the way. I think I told y'all it's May 11th. Uh, and then when I get back, I'm going to, I'm debating on if I want to take my hair down and wear my natural hair to, tonight, or if I just wanna deal with the braids and worry about my hair next week. And I think that's what I'm gonna do because I wanna kinda keep cleaning the house and prepping that and taking y'all through some of that stuff today. So I don't know what we're gonna do just yet, but I don't feel like this place is open either. That means I have to go off base to a gas station and I really wasn't trying to do that. Dang, there is like nobody else. Oh my goodness. I gotta find the address for where I have to drop her off at. It wasn't too far. It almost looked like it was near my job, my well, my old job. Dang it, I didn't save the email. Oh. Well, I didn't like. Oh, they're not open. Why is nothing open? Six. I get that it's the weekend, but what about the people that live on base? <sighs> okay, y'all. Let me go see if the other one is open. And if the other one not open, then I guess we just gonna go off base. What we doing? And this is my fault because I should have went. I was literally in Target yesterday and in the snack area because I went and got my poppy drinks and didn't realize until I got home that I was like, well, I can go to a gas station or somewhere. So we just gonna have to go to a gas station off base. But I'm about to check this last little place right here. Take a picture of this and save. I'm just saying, why do we have to stop? There's nobody on the road. Girl, because it's a stop sign. Or a traffic light. That's why. I don't know why. There's no one on the road. It ain't got to be nobody on the road, girl. You got to follow the rules. Hmm. You you go ahead and run that little uh, light. It's going to be a police find you at some point. Okay, let's see. <laughs> 40, 20. Oh, boom. 4020 Murphy Canyon Road. Okay, it ain't but 10 minutes away. Perfect. So, y'all are leaving at 7. Y'all come back at 5. That's going to be too late because my going away at 6 and it's literally the opposite way of the highway. So, I'll probably pick you up. Well, you just got to call me and tell me when you're ready. If it's before, um, if it's not before 4. Okay, because I, I at least want to eat the food. I'm not going to come that early. Oh, okay. I'm not coming till like 3. Y'all have lunch probably in the middle of the day. Y'all literally finna be gone from 7 to 5. And I believe that's because of the transportation. This one don't look open either. Oh my goodness, y'all. I'm gonna be back once we find a gas station to go to. Yeah, this one's not open either. So, I guess I was just being too optimistic. So... Oh, wait. That one. That, girl, that is not open. The lights are on. Yeah, but they're not open. Yeah, yeah. they're closed. Okay. I'll be back, y'all. Y'all, we made it inside 7-Eleven, and she trying to look for stuff. Small bag, because I don't want to come in. Small bag. We just left Starbucks, too, so we went to Starbucks first. So, I'm just in here trying to have her get some snacks. They got goldfish right here. Need something that you're gonna be able to eat throughout the day. Gummy bears. You eat gummy bears? I do. Okay. 
y'all this little 7 eleven got a few little things yeah other chips back here more little chips and stuff so they got they so spread out in here y'all someone um, did like a bring your Oh, mommy, don't, you, don't you get those? Yeah, but I don't want them, honey. I got a coffee cake in the car. Okay. That I'm trying to get back to. Okay. All right, y'all. So we in 7-Eleven. I'll, I'll see y'all once we get in the car and I get to the place to drop her off. But every... Park right here? Okay. But every time, girl... You better just put that black jacket on. I don't know what to tell you there, honey. What She got on a green shirt. It should cover your butt, though. Yeah, we just pulled up. So, let me get her situated, and then I'll be right back. Because, baby, they got this place all hey, locked down. Y'all hear my mama was talking about, hey, hey y'all. We can't, like, oh no. Hey, you won't be back in time. Girl, I won't be back in time. I'll be back, y'all. Girl, the things we do for our kids, honey. I done ran home. Well, not literally, but I done went home to grab my daughter this little wrinkle behind shirt that she done left. Because anytime they have, like, the little events and stuff, y'all, this is the shirt that they be having to wear um they are with like the actual police department so they are at an actual police station uh right now so i'm praying that i can make it back to her before the police like before they actually leave so girl i'm trying to get there say i got nine minutes so hopefully hopefully the bus don't show up and that kids are still getting dropped off so it's been a lot this morning okay um i'm sharing my location with her too so that way she can see that i'm almost there you know when i'm there and stuff like that so she better be lucky okay she got a mama because baby i was just home i could stay home but no i don't i don't like her feeling left out and you know i personally don't like feeling left out either like you know dang i don't have my shirt and stuff like that so i like to if I can do it and I can go drop it off to her, I'm going to go do that. So, I'm about to go do that, take that to munch, and then I'm going to take my butt back to the house and start cleaning up. I just tried to call my mom back. I've been on the phone with my mom this entire morning. Um, Michelle, so happy. She's loving the little event and stuff like that. But they told me that they are coming back at 5.30, which means... We're gonna have to go pick her up, y'all. So y'all have to come with me to go pick her up later today because 5.30, honey, my going away is at six o'clock. Now, mind you, I am the type that gets to places on time 15 minutes early, <laughs> but I'm thinking I'm gonna go pick her up probably around uh, three-ish, maybe. I'll probably leave here at three, go grab her. It's like a 45 minute to an hour drive with no traffic. But it may take me 30 minutes. So 30 minutes there, 30 minutes back. And then she can come home, shower, get dressed, and then we all can drive out to my going away. So yes, honeys, let me go ahead and finish doing my motherly duties this morning and get my baby her jacket or her shirt so she's not left out. And then I'ma let y'all know how it turns out. Let's fingers crossed that I get there on time. I'm hoping. So we're gonna see. Let's see, y'all. Let's see. <laughs> I'm nervous. Y'all, I think we're gonna make it. I think we're gonna make it. <laughs> we're gonna make it. Period. My mother's calling me back, but y'all, we're down the street, so I'll let y'all know. Mission was a success, babies. Yes, yes. So now my daughter is all upset. Well, she happy she got her shirt, but they originally told me that they were going to be back at 4.30 when I dropped her off earlier. And I was like, okay, bet. Like, I was thinking five, so they can actually bring her back themselves. But now, the lady confirmed with me, and she said 
mind y'all they were supposed to leave at seven y'all it's 7 35 and they still sitting there not going nowhere so they still sitting there so i just told my baby like i'm gonna have to come and pick you up like we're gonna have to come pick you up and then head to the place because i can't wait until 5 30 and then that's if they even get back at 5 30 y'all so we'll see we'll just play it by ear i'll have her let me know and keep me updated with what's going on and try to save her battery and stuff but if i had to go pick her up then i just gotta go pick her up and so she's all upset oh but y'all it's seven o'clock in the morning they not get back till five that's a full day girl so she'll be all right she should be fine and then my mama like your people that you're going away will be fine too they there for you i'm like y'all so we'll just play it by ear but of course i'm gonna take y'all through my whole day i'm really about to just go back to the house and um clean good morning yeah we're going in you too thank you you too um, so I'm really about to just go back to the house, clean up. I was just on the phone with my mom, but the phone hung up, I guess. But yeah, it's almost time. Y'all, it's the 11th. That means I have 13 days. How many days I got to live? Cause 10 will be 21. Yes, I have 13 days left here in Cali. I'm excited y'all this vlog has been long because I started at the beginning of the month I think and it's just gonna be a nice long vlog for y'all I won't start a new one until I um because with the movers and stuff that's gonna be included in the moving vlog but I won't start a new vlog until we actually get on the road and start driving so Y'all are going to see Munch leave with her dad. Um, it's Y'all going to see a lot. So, y'all, I'm just going to take y'all through my whole little journey. Last night, I'm pretty sure I put some footage in there. But if I didn't, last night, Chris and I went to a seafood place. Zero out of ten. Y'all, I don't give it nothing. Like, the only thing I would give it, I'd probably give it a one or a two out of ten. Because they gave me extra crab legs. But, babe, when I tell you it didn't stick like when i tell you all the juice was at the bottom of the bag and then when you poured the crab bowl out the crab legs was plain like they were they look like crab legs they weren't dirty or nothing but i want my crab legs to be dirty i want the sauce to be sticking to the crabs and it wasn't doing that it was so nasty when i tell y'all it was nasty it was so nasty so i told them don't ever take me back to that place ever so we went there and then we also went back and got that ice cream i know i said i wasn't gonna go back but we went back and got an ice cream sandwich and then we came back to the house but i also went and got the kids teachers like a gift like a um for teacher appreciation week because i didn't get them anything last week so i went to target got them a gift so we actually got to put that together this weekend and then we went into target and hobby lobby we went in target to get the teacher stuff but then i also went to go get me 10 poppies so that'll like last me until i leave because i usually just drink one a day um and that'll last me until i leave and stuff so we did that yesterday after i picked the kids up yesterday was my last day of work as well girly so it's getting real it's getting real so i just made it back to the house I'm about to go in here um, and start to clean up a little bit more. I'll show y'all that too because I really ain't really got much on the agenda for today. I do need to take my shoes back. So if we get out the house before then, I'll probably take her shoes back to Jeremy's and get her a bigger size. But I actually need her to be there with me so that way I don't get another small size. Because, girl, I got her a size 8 in women Crocs. Don't y'all know they was too big, too small? Y'all, they was too small. So I got to go get a bigger size. But I need her to be with me because I don't want to have to go back again because she can't fit them. So let me get in this house and all of that. Let me throw my little evidence away so Mally don't be like, you didn't get me any Starbucks? That's not fair. He should have went. I told him to come. He didn't want to come. Oh, well. It was me and lunch time. So I'm just glad that I was able to run back out there and give her her shirt and she got her shirt. So 
I'll see y'all in, in a minute. Hey, Michelle, Michelle, got it. Did you get a video? Mm -hmm. It's on a video. And one photo. Right. Get one. Get, get a video. We have to go, guys. Hi, no, no, she liked that. She liked that. Michelle. Hey, Horsey. How you doing? You look so cute. I love you. You too. There we go. There we go. All right, Michelle. I can show y'all my laundry room now. Because <laughs> I'm cleaning it up. But I'm in here about to do my laundry. Because, baby, I ran in here to try to find Shell's shirt earlier. Girl, it was stinking here. Like, it was giving mildew. And that just lets me know it's time to wash my clothes. I can't do that smell. I, I can't handle that, honey. So, I'm about to put a load of laundry on. That's going to be my focus today is the laundry. But as y'all can see, the, the house is getting, you know, put together, girlies. <laughs> yes. It's getting put together. I separate my clothes dark, light, and white. That's how I, I that's how I separate my clothes. So and then I put my uniforms, like my ABUs and stuff, that all gets like one big pile. So let me put y'all over here. Where it's a little bit I feel like it's a little bit more light. But yeah, that all gets one pile and everything. So yes, girl. But baby, it is so slight. And then I do my towels separate also. So I have like a bunch of pals on the floor. Usually I don't have that much white clothes though, cause much, it mainly be her stuff. But I got uh, quite a few white clothes today, which is kind of interesting. It's not too many clothes in here, but it's enough for me to go ahead and start a load. She only got one more day of like her little safety patrol because she do it every Monday and she only got this Monday coming up and then she got Sunday or is it Sunday? She got this Monday coming up and then she has, I feel like the lighting, if I put y'all over there, is trash, but I'm going to put y'all there. Hopefully it still keeps it bright. And not because you can't adjust the lighting on this camera, but yeah, she only got one more day, y'all. So it's kind of exciting, it's like bittersweet. But this is all I'm gonna do today, really, is just focus on the laundry because, girl, it needs to be done. The smell that is coming up off these clothes, baby, I can't take it. And the door to the laundry room was closed. Mm-mm. I can't take it, honey. Y'all know I don't vlog a lot or really um in one day. Cause why is the camera down to one notch already? And it's only 7.45 in the morning, which means girl, we gotta go put it on the charger. So let me do my laundry finish my laundry and then when i finish that i'll come back i'll go ahead and put the camera on the charger too so y'all have seen me do laundry plenty of times so let me do that and then i'll be back a little bit later because this is all i'm about to do right now Girl, I just got up from a nap, honey. It was so needed. Oh my goodness. Oh. Um, it's, what time is it? 12.03. I think I got like two or three more loads of laundry to do. But Saturday, May 11th, Munch has already called me. 
telling me about her day and telling me, you know, what she been doing and stuff. They was eating lunch when she called me and they still had some stuff to do. So she was so excited. <laughs> so I got one load of laundry already done and then I have the other one. Girl, one thing about it. I don't think I put deodorant on this morning, but when I got dressed, y'all, so I don't know if it wore off, like, and last night when I was in the dog, when I got out the shower, because, baby, I feel musty, and I just been laying in the bed. I don't like that, so I was supposed to do, like, some cleaning today, but I'm going to be honest. I'm in the mood to just kind of relax because I just feel like this upcoming week, when I tell y'all it's going to be busy with me, it's going to be busy. So I kind of just want to enjoy my weekend, relaxing, because it's kind of that saying, the calm before the storm, because baby, I just know this next week is about to go by fast. And it's about to be crazy. So I actually have what was that? I actually have let's see three more loads of laundry to do. I went and separated the actually I got four more loads. I went and separated the pants. Um his pants and my pants because of course you know their clothes are a little bigger than myself and it well than what I'm used to washing. So I made a pile of all the pants, but I'm gonna do the white clothes right now. Because I still gotta wash my uniform and I still have to wash the sheets or the, what do I gotta do? I gotta do the, the sheet, the washcloths and the towels and then the pants. So, Let's just, oh, that's too much. We need all that. So let's just go ahead and knock that out. And I need to go find me something to eat in this kitchen because I'm kind of hungry as well. So let me go grab my phone because my best friend just sent me some pictures. And I think it's of her baby graduating. Not graduating, but I think it's like some photos from her graduation or something. Let's see. I'm just taking out through the day with us, and that's exactly what it is. Oh, they look so cute. These are so pretty. She looks so pretty. Just starting. I'm done. Oh, y'all, these pictures are so freaking cute this is my favorite one she got her back she got joy in the front saying just starting and then she got her daughter jayla in the back saying i'm done that is so freaking cute i love it oh it's so cute that takes a bit so let me see. She also had me, she told me that my best friend told me to go get this book called The Woman. So when we was in Target yesterday, I actually saw it. So I'm gonna start reading it and then she done already finished it. So she's like, you gotta read it so that we can talk about it. So I'm gonna read that. I'm gonna start back my reading, especially like on the trip up and all of that. Um, and go from there. So Chris has some stuff to do at work this morning. And now he's getting a haircut. I, I'm hungry right now. But I don't want to eat nothing too heavy right now. Because I want to save my appetite for later. <laughs> Y'all because that place was so good when we went. And. But I'm hungry. I need something to like snack on for the time being. I need something like super light. And when I tell y'all ain't nothing in this house. Baby ain't nothing in this house. Because we're moving so it's not like i'm buying food i wish i had like some jelly or something so i could have maybe like a piece of toast and some eggs but 
you know, when everything goes fails, this is, this might be why I'm gaining weight. This might be why I'm gaining weight. Y'all, when I tell y'all obsess, I, ugh, tell me it's the salt or whatever, but I'm gonna take these two upstairs. So I'm just finna munch on these little nuts. These like this trail mix. I love it so much. It tastes so good. And that's just what I'm about to do. I'm not really finna do anything. I'm just about to go back upstairs. I'm not folding up no clothes until all the clothes are done. So tomorrow. Or later, whenever Chris gets back. And I'ma let the kids put the teacher stuff together. Let me show y'all what I got for the teachers. And then I'll show y'all the bag that I got from Amazon later when I bring it in the house. But I ended up getting let me go with this bag. Put my blanket over me. Put this, I gotta wash these blankets. So I hope y'all can see me. So I ended up getting these two little cups for them. I thought these were so cute, perfect for like summertime. And I'm going to ask them, you know, which teacher would like what. I was going to get the same ones because both of the teachers don't give me like girly girl. They kind of give me like, that. If does that make sense? Like they don't give me, I want hot pink and stuff like that. They just give me, I don't know, but I got two different colors. I honestly should have got both of them this color because I feel like this match. I really feel like if we being honest, this match Munch teacher and this match Malachi teacher. Um, so I got these. Of course, if they don't want them, they can gift them. So I got these for them. And they gotta wash them anyway. And then I've got, I feel like everybody loves Dr. Teal's like foaming bath. So I got some foaming bath. Um, this is always something that I love getting women just because I feel like we take baths more than Amanda's, but not take baths like all the time. But it's good to just have, you know, in your cabinet when you just want to do a little self care. Then I got Sharpies. I got a pack of highlighters and then I got a pack of sticky notes, the little pastel Target brand. So I got a pack of sticky notes as well. And then I ended up getting this, um, this like primer that I want to try tonight when I do my makeup for my going away. I also need to see what all of us are wearing. So maybe we can go out when he gets done and find like a little matching outfit for all of us. I was thinking something yellow, but I don't think Bubba has anything yellow. So, I don't know, girl. Oh, let me show y'all Bubba pictures. They look so cute. I'm also finna turn the TV on and watch something and wait on him to get back. And then we'll go do something. But y'all, my Bubba looks so handsome. Timmy is not true. So that's what he looks like. And then let me show y'all Munch. Now with this one, this one gonna be kind of hard to show y'all because it has, I'll blur it out. But this is Munch pictures, y'all. Oh my goodness. My baby looks so pretty. She looks so cute. Uh, y'all, I have a fifth grader. Can y'all believe it? Like I have a fifth grader. <sighs> so her dad actually sent me half of the money for this package that he was wanting to do where basically I split them in half. I honestly probably am going to get them sent to his house and then he can mail me back my half of the pictures. But I think we're going to go with post three because post three looks so cute. Um, and that way I, the pictures don't get sent to my house or sent to my grandma's house because I got a, I got all my mail being forwarded to my, get girl, get off my pants. Get up. Move. Now you got a whole bed over there and you want to lay on my clothes. But hopefully that way they can get sent to my grandma. They don't get sent to my grandma's house, but, um, I've been seeing this all over the media. The little e.l.f. Stay Cool Primer Stick. And I wanted to try it. So it's an after applying skincare swipe and then follow with makeup. So it's like a base. Um, but I've seen mixed reviews. I feel like everything gets mixed reviews. 
but there's also this lip stain that i want to go buy so yeah we going out the house we getting out the house when he get back i'm gonna just throw my little clothes on i had on earlier i'm gonna wipe under my arms too and apply reapply my <laughs> my uh deodorant because clearly it wasn't enough but i'm also sitting here watching a uh, mother of the bride and so far it was good it was so cute so i'm about to finish watching that eat some of these little trail mix nuts and i'm about to relax because girl i'm telling y'all next week is about to be crazy so i want to just chill let me show y'all the book I feel like I'm all over the place, but this is the book my best friend was talking about. And so I'm going to be reading this um, at some point. It's pretty hefty. It was $21 at Target. Of course, if you go on Amazon, it's $18. But I feel like for convenience and the book right there, I just went and bought it from Target and called it a day. But it is cheaper on Amazon as like everything is. So let me watch my movie. Um, plug my little phone up too. And I'm going to see y'all in a little bit. I'll probably, next time I see y'all, we'll probably be out running errands trying to go find some stuff. So, I'll, I'll be back. I'm trying to see which outfit I want to wear. So, I have this. I'm trying to cover myself up. Um, but I have these black tights with this shirt that I got from, I think, Sheen. Sheen, Sheen. So, it's just a plain shirt. It's very open in the front. That's why I'm definitely wearing tights up under it. But it's super long. So on me, y'all, it comes down to like my ankles. So this is an option with the black tights. Or I'm going to wear some jeans with this shirt that I pretty much always have on. Basically the one that we wore with the uni uniform, lower it. The outfit we wore for New Year's and Christmas. And I had that black shirt on. So that's an option. I just don't know which one I want to wear. Obviously, also which one I can fit. Because I don't already y'all have already seen, baby. The way this stomach and these rows and these legs going. I don't know which one will fit. So I'm about to try both of them on and see which one I like best. And I'm going to show y'all too so y'all can pick. Obviously, by the time y'all see this, y'all can already <laughs> see what I chose. But... I really feel like this one's going to fit the best, but I don't know if it's going to look the best. So, let me try both of them on, and I'm going to show y'all both of them. So, hold on. This is the first outfit. Y'all can't really see the shoes, but they're like the little shoes, the little knit shoes that I got from Shein too. I don't know if I like the shoes. Let me see if I go out the room, if y'all can see the full outfit. But this is what it's looking like. I don't know if I like the shoes too much. I feel like... If I have on maybe something short, like maybe some shorts with these, it'll look like just with a little bit of skin showing under. But I don't know. I really like the top. So, I just don't have those shoes to go with it. So, this is option number one. Let me try on the other option first and let's make sure I can fit these pants. So, I'm going to come back for the second one. Okay, y'all. This is option number two. I don't know. As soon as I put this on, I felt super comfortable. Now, I don't know if I'm going to wear the shoes that I have on with this. I'm definitely going to tuck my shirt in because I don't like it hanging over. But let me see if y'all can see it with the shoes. So, these are the shoes. I don't have them zipped up or anything. But these are like my go-to just fab brown boots that I always wear. One when my toes are not done. And I just want a little mm. But... Even if we don't wear these shoes, we're going to wear something cute. So, this is the second option. This is actually the only option I have. So, I'm probably going to end up going with this one just because it's super comfortable and it's more me. The other one was comfortable too. I just don't have the right shoes. So, I guess y'all just have to see what I choose. So, I'm about to go ahead and get dressed and stuff. It's 3.30. Um, Munch has not texted me back yet. I don't know why her little butt ain't texted me back yet. I don't call her and text her. Her location does say that she's still at the same place. Um, uh, cause we have Life 360 on all of our phones. Like everybody's. My mama, my cousin Michelle, my, both my kids. I do. Chris has it. His mom has it. So we all got each other's location, which I love. So we're on Life 360. And so 
it says that she's been there since what since eight something this morning or 8 56 so she's still there but i need her to text me let me know that way once we leave the house i know we're not coming back home so i need to do my makeup get dressed and everything so i'm just gonna go ahead and get dressed as if we're gonna leave here go pick her up from the place and then come back i do have clothes already picked out for her for her to like do like a quick wipe off change and stuff that way she not with the same clothes that she's had on so we'll see but let me go ahead and figure out what i'm about to wear y'all and then i'm gonna come back once i'm all dressed and stuff and i done figured it out and my hair i gotta do something with this hair because it's gotta come out this weekend so let's see what we're gonna do y'all i ended up going with outfit number one but i think it was number one but i'm going girl i got a tampon in my hand i'm wearing these shoes right here somewhere in these um my cycle's on so i got you know some stuff but then i have my daughter's clothes y'all i'm gonna tell y'all about my little scare just now once i get in the car oh my goodness we are about to leave right now go pick munch up but girl let me tell you what just happened because i ain't got i ain't get back on the vlog for a reason i'm gonna get my daughter she get her little booty in this car but i just wanted to let y'all know that i was dressed and i can't give y'all no outfit but i think i kind of showed y'all i did my makeup and stuff so i got some flats on right now though before we get there so baby is out there getting a duffel bag so i can put much clothes in there let me see y'all once i get in the car Hey y'all, so I hope the angle is not too bad. Y'all see I'm on this side of the car, but Beverly Sam, my daughter had me on edge. That's all I'm gonna say. She had me on edge and I legit was so nervous. I didn't know what was going on. She y'all she was not answering her phone. I was getting frustrated because I'm like, I should have just went with my first instinct and picked her up. But they are on their way back. And we about to just go sit in the parking lot. Y'all, my screen not even coming on my car. At this point, I'm just going to see y'all later. I had a scare with Munch. She was not answering the phone. And now she is on their way back. And I am just about to go to the place to wait on her to where she was at where she's at so that same place i was at earlier today i'm about to just go wait on her there and then we're gonna be late to my going away so i need to text um the girl who is running it and let her know um so yeah that's what we about to, that's what we're doing right now heading to go pick munch up and then i brought like Yo, some clothes and stuff for her and all of that and then yeah so i believe we should be good to go i got my phone i got my camera and we should be good i got hand sanitizer y'all we are ready we good we finna go buy these bank real quick though so i can deposit some money into the bank from my cash envelope so that my bank can be can you go to this one so that my bank can be balanced and stuff so I'll see y'all when we do something a little bit more exciting. I also got this little portable charger. I know my phone is completely dead, so I'm gonna let charge her little phone up to a little bit. But I got this mainly for the road trip. I got it off Amazon, y'all. It's like a you can go through drive through. Um, it's got like a iPhone, old iPhone charger, like the normal one before they switch to USB C. It has an outlet. And then it has a USB-C and then a micro S like USB, whatever that is. And then you can put a normal USB right here and then another USB-C. So I really like this. And it tells you what the percentage is on the thing yeah. on the front. So I'm going to let Munch use this when she gets in the car. So let me deposit this money and I'll be back. An ocean for me. For the dumb shit and the damage you've done Cause I've been crying oceans for weeks Try to fight it but I'm drowning alone Sister save me now Save me now Whoa. Sister save me now Save me now Whoa. 
y'all we just pulled up and they're not here y'all know i told y'all they told us 4 30 or 5 5 30 now it is 5 15 so they ain't showed up yet but but as soon as they get here i need my daughter and we got to get down the highway because it is 5 13 and we are nowhere near close to where we're supposed to be at at six o'clock so let's just hope that it's not chaotic when they getting off the buses and stuff because much phone is completely dead so Come on. i'll give y'all an update but we're here at this police department um little place i'm actually glad we got here right at this moment because we ain't got to worry about it now earlier i got blocked in so i had to wait a little bit i smooth got blocked in but i'm gonna give y'all an update as the updates come my daughter phone is completely dead so it's not like i could text her and be like how far y'all at or see her location so i guess we'll see it sucks for the parents that got here at 4 30 kind of sort of but Laurie, they Laurie, is a little Laurie. close and they got in line way sooner than we did so i guess we just go see and group field trips are so much fun you have fun yes what'd you do so we went hiking at the very end of the day because i don't know other people were hiking so then we also went to ride horses i said i wasn't gonna get on one but i did and um a horse actually willow the horse she actually like lifted her head up where my hand was and let me pat her and then jj when i was like scratching behind his ears he would like lean over <laughs> the way i could do that and then we were just making like leather bracelets um what else we did? Mm -hmm. Oh, but, we did uh, a shoe, not shoe, but like. Y'all did a lot. Yeah, and I was tired. I fell asleep with Olivia. But. So you finna be tired. Let me see your phone because I got to charge up. Okay, thank you. Because it's at like 3% or something. If it's not even charged, I think it died. I turned my phone off. Oh, you turned it off. Y'all, it's 6 o'clock. So. It's saying we'll get there at like 6 15 ish but i'm gonna see y'all once we get to the restaurant but she made it back she's here safe and sound and now we're heading she got a splinter and now my but finger she hurts. said she got it out and she said now her finger hurts so she gonna probably be real tired at this restaurant and yeah you probably gonna be tired you want to go home mm -mm. Uh, so I'll see y'all once we get to the restaurant though. You got anything to say? Mm -hmm. <laughs> got, got free life insurance? <laughs> Did you do the, B, the, the, the BGLI? <laughs> well, ma'am, uh, we're gonna miss you, definitely. Um, but you know, do new beginnings and everything, getting excited. Uh, going to Washington, you know, back to the cold. Didn't you come from Alaska? Okay, not as cool. Um, but obviously, we're definitely gonna miss you. Uh, we're feeling it. Uh, these guys. Can I miss her? Uh, yeah, me and Umanu, we put together something for you, but like luck will have it. It's not here. So we're gonna get it together and I'm gonna walk around so all of you guys can sign it. Okay? But we did an old fashioned. It was like my idea, but you knew like totally support it. So got you like a little sign, but it's gonna come with a little now this one's gonna get like adjusted with air force stuff but we got you like a cute little funk pop so yeah and we put a dog we put a dog like a little pop. the box is cute too so can i say like go to and sorry and uh sorry uh harrington so something goofy and stuff and, but at the same time cute so hopefully you like it some flowers for you but you yeah, are gonna miss it Oh. I can just no, I don't have nothing. Oh, come on. No, I don't have mm. nothing. Speech. All I'm going to say is thank you for y'all that show up. It means a lot. I appreciate it. I'm going to miss y'all, but I'm definitely ready to get out of recruiting. <laughs> now, everybody knows that. I'm yeah. ready to go. Um, but it, it was fun. It's been four years. I've enjoyed it. And so keep in touch. Yeah, so that's all. That's it. That's all. <laughs> that's
back. Who oh, y'all? Yes, you did. What? I did not record at all at my going away, y'all. But I took yeah, pictures. But I didn't record. Well, Sorry, but I do got some photos. I got a picture of my little foodie. But we just leaving the place right now. About to head back home. What? Where you post? Party Pablo. Cargo story. It's okay. You you done already took off. I was wondering why you're stopping. Uh, so yeah. We're about to head to the house now because y'all my daughter is sleepy. She tired. It's time to go. Oh so God. I got a card from my um co-worker. Well my old OP. Wow. And I wanna open it with y'all because I'm excited. And then I'll show y'all the picture when I get to the house because it's um y'all gotta see it. It's so cute. It is so cute. That was the party. Well, I'm grown. So they got me a card. I also got me a Starbucks gift card for my drive up because they know your girl loves some Starbucks. Okay. So I got me a Starbucks gift card as well. And I am so grateful for that. It's so cute. I got to load this on to my app. I'm actually going to do that so I don't forget. <clears throat> but let me... And then I showed y'all. Oh, I didn't show y'all the flowers. Y'all saw the flowers in the picture, but I'll show y'all the flowers when I get home. But it says some people are really, really easy to like and really, really hard to say goodbye to. Shamika, Michelle, Malachi, we can't believe it's that time already. Thank you for all of the uh, fun memories together. We wish you all the best in this new um, adventure. We love you all so much. We should keep in touch. Hope to see you all soon. God bless you all. Love the Tomiyagas. It's so cute. Yes, y'all. It's from my OP. I'm going to talk to y'all once I get to the house because it's a little, it's getting dark. So, I'm going to see y'all once we get to the house. That's what I'm doing tonight, y'all watching. Y'all can't really see it. Good morning, y'all. It's the next day and girl, it's the next day. <laughs> Good morning. I wanted to show y'all these flowers that I got yesterday for my going away, y'all. They are so pretty. I gotta put them on some uh, water. So they don't die, but y'all look. Oh my gosh. These are so pretty. They're so freaking cute. Mm. It's just such a thoughtful gift. So I'm gonna put my flowers in a vase today because they've been sitting out all night. I didn't get a chance to do it last night. But because when we got in the house, we were tired. So let me get a vase. And then, mm, perfect. One right here. And then I'm going to put my flowers in my vase. And I'm going to set them on the table for now. Y'all, they're so pretty. I'm going to fill this up with some water and some ice. I use these little ice cubes that I got to put the ice in there. And I need to cut the stem so overall the going away was super it was good. Um I had fun. It was a lot of fun. This morning, actually, I didn't even get to say nothing, y'all. Happy Mother's Day. Today's Mother's Day. Happy, happy, happy Mother's Day to y'all. Um, to all the mommies, what did y'all do? I am hanging out. I am hanging out today, later today. Hold on, girl. Hold on, y'all. I'm hanging out today, though. Later today. And then I'm going to just be chilling. Oh, yes. I got my flower food. Yes, yes, yes. I'm glad I got flower food. These roses are so pretty. 
But that's really all we're gonna be doing today, hanging out, doing nothing, just chilling. And just enjoying each other's presence. So I'm going to take the stems out. This is what I'll be seeing the girlies do. So this is what I'm gonna do. I just need to see how far I need to cut. I feel like I need to cut. how I cut them though because you know, I, I, I did not do a good job cutting them but they're all in I feel like this one's just a little bit too long or it's not going all the way down let's see girl they cut all kinds of ass. let's just do this I gotta go pick that up they don't flew across the room Gotta cut this one. So two. So. <laughs> Baby, don't. I'm not a florist, okay? Nor am I a girly that get flowers like all the time and be knowing what to do with them. But I will say these are so freaking pretty. They are gorgeous. Let's have a, like a few little pieces. Okay, they look a little better, but here are my beautiful flowers and they're blooming. They look so good. They look so good. They're so pretty. But this is what I got for my going away. Um, one, because the item that they got me is not, um, it, it, oh, it was late. So <clears throat> they didn't get it in time. So they'll get it once it comes. But I love the flowers. It was so cute. And they're pink, so they're even prettier. So I'm gonna put these on my desk or on my table. The camera's blinking at me right now. Um, <clears throat> not really much going on today or this morning. I'm about to honestly go get back in the bed and lay down because I just want to relax this entire weekend and do nothing because I just know this upcoming week is about to just be go 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 so i might start a new vlog then because i feel like when i looked at the footage on this one girl we was at two hours without being edited and there was really not much that i need to edit out so we'll see <clears throat> excuse me but i'll be back i'm gonna put my flowers on my table and then i'll see y'all in a little bit Eggs, bacon, potato. I almost just fell out this chair. That's crazy. And a little drinky drink. It's so funny. <laughs> that would not be funny. <laughs> the little chair is. You, want this one? you said that to me before. Funny. You told me he never knew her. What's funny? And my French toasty. Oh, the word side. And my French toast. Oh, my Let me dig in my Mother's Day meal. <laughs> Oh, and my little flowers. Hey, y'all. Before I end this vlog and start a new one, 
This is this is new. Yeah. Why? What you mean it's new? You opened it already. Where's the other one? I think they both opened. Why you open both of these? Uh, sorry, y'all. Shell was bringing me some deodorant. Anywho, um, so I got this for their teachers for Teacher Appreciation Week. It's like a little bag. I'm also on the phone, with my mom. It's a little bag that says teacher life. It say it takes a big heart to help shape little minds. And then it's this teacher life bag. And so let me show y'all what I got. The, both of the teachers got the same thing. So I'm only going to show one. I'm pretty sure I showed y'all the little cups that I got. So we're going to take this one for Malachi teacher. And then I actually think I showed y'all what I got them already. The Dr. Till's little restore and replenish. I'm pretty sure I did. Uh, the kids picked the little wristlet that they wanted for their specific teacher. So they got the little zebra one. They both chose that one. Um, and then the highlighters, the sticky notes. I'm pretty sure I showed y'all all this already. And then I had some little um, tissues. And so that is what I got them that they're going to take this week. Because <laughs> y'all know their mama forgot last week. I ran out of time. And then for Michelle's teacher, she got the literally the same thing. She just got... The pink like watermelon type cup. And, then this. and that's what they got for teacher appreciation week. So yeah. Um, I'm actually about to go ahead and start a new vlog. I'm pre-pooing my hair right now. So when I get back, I'm going to wash it, deep condition it, go get on the treadmill and all of that. And then I'll be back to talk to y'all. But y'all will see that in a new vlog. So I'll see y'all in another vlog but bye y'all thank y'all for watching i'll bye. see y'all later bye bye y'all my mama say bye. Yeah. bye it's time to go take them to school got nine minutes